a vlog mess, I'm not really sure. <laughs> Had a couple of days off because I was prioritizing me um, and just having some time to kind of get back into a routine after a busy week at work. Just kind of not stress out about needing to do so much in the evenings and unwind and hopefully sleep well and all of this stuff. I am feeling a little bit worse for wear after such a busy week. Oh my gosh, it's so windy. I was about to go outside for a run. Ugh. I might still try. <laughs> um, today is Friday and it's the Friday before Christmas, which is exciting. Um, today I am studying from home. Um, I'm meeting up with a friend at 11 o'clock to take her case history so that I can write it up and do a nutritional prescription and a uh, supplements prescription for her, which is part of what I have to do for my nutrition degree. So that'll be nice of doing that in the morning and then I will work on that in the afternoon. Um, we're going to a place called Leaf Wild, which is a nice vegan cafe in Notting Hill. And can we just also appreciate how beautiful is my Christmas bouquet? It was such a mess this morning. Apologies. Still tastes great. I'm just at Leaf Wild waiting for Saskia and it's very quiet in here. Um, I've got a coconut decaf latte, a bit of a mouthful, and they're out of oat milk, as is the whole world. So I had to go coconut, which I don't love, but it's better than the alternative. never seen black radish before. So interesting. Might try some of that. It's been a very bad vlogger today. I've almost sort of forgotten about vlog this. Um, because I just had lunch, I didn't vlog it, but it was a very basic um, eggs and avocado on toast. I'm just thinking about little puds now and then cracking into some work. Change of plan, I'm gonna make a smoothie. greens powder in, quarter of a banana, some plant milk, what else, some peanut butter, pretty simple but really nice. The reason I use the greens powder in is, bleh. the reason I use the greens powder is because it has a lot of iodine in from all the things like spirulina and stuff, which is so good for your thyroid. Your little snacky snacky. Sourdough from Dalesford. Organic peanut butter. St. Dalford jam. Coming. Just jumping on to say that I am really grateful for my health. It sounds like a terrible thing to say actually, but it's since becoming nutritionist, well, nearly. <laughs> I have a diploma in nutrition, but I'm almost fully qualified. Um, and doing patient case histories, that it's really just made me think, you know how you always just think you're, you're at the center of the universe and your problems are worse than everybody else's. It's just not the case. It's really not the case. I think other people handle stuff differently and maybe their problems don't come out so much on the surface like mine did. Just really grateful for where I am now and for the knowledge that I have and then using that knowledge to heal myself and make myself better has just been the most invaluable life lesson. So excited and happy and can't wait to kind of help others in the same way and you know spread that message of treating the cause and not the symptom and you know really looking after each different organ system and your mental health and how it all plays into one big pot um, of healing. So yeah, I'm just writing up a patient's case history now. I'm just feeling grateful. So I thought I would share that in the spirit of Christmas and you know, stuff. <laughs>
Anyway, I hope everyone's having a great day. It's quite a slow one for me. Um, I am popping into my husband's studio in a couple of hours, which is just downstairs. Um, not that fancy. He has been in Canada recording a new album recently with a snazzy producer who I forget the name of, uh, James, someone. Um, and he would like me to sing backing vocals on some of his tracks for him, which is really cool. And he's been bugging me to get in the studio for so long, but as I had that terrible cold and sounded like a man until quite recently, we haven't really got it done. So I promised him I'd give him some time today. So that should be exciting. Is the pulse within my chest that aches? But who am I to? Sinking my maybe getting a little bit this bit. When you sleep at night. But supper is some deliciously Ella black bean sweet potato shepherd's pie, loads of organic broccoli, a little bit of brown rice pasta, and some leftover butternut squash. It's actually kabocha squash, which is supposed to be very good. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog here with my lovely meal of food. I was feeling a bit lazy, so I got something out of the freezer, but it's all good ingredients, so that's fine. And see you tomorrow. Nearly Christmas.